It's delivery time at Chap's restaurant. However, the boxes aren't filled with food, but with t-shirts. The restaurant, like many around the state and country, is shut down. Um, when I had to announce it to my staff, it had created so much um, emotional unrest. Everyone is um, scared and not knowing how to go forward and what questions have remained unanswered. But a break in daily life gave life to an idea for owner Celeste Shaw. I had printed a t-shirt and an apron several years ago with the words food is love and my first thought was is could I sell those to generate some income for the staff. As a restaurant owner, Shaw knows that workers often live on limited income and missed paychecks can mean personal financial chaos. According to nonprofit Big Table, approximately one in six restaurant workers live below the poverty level, and the executive director believes the numbers are likely worse. Shaw felt an immediate need to respond. These are people that I know and love, and then I also recognize that it really, it's not even about my restaurant, it's about an industry and a community in general. In that spirit, she called her local printer. Shaw created these t-shirts with her mantra, food is love. It's not about eating, it's not about food, it's about feeding your soul and feeding um, the feeling that you're not alone. The profits from the shirts will go to Big Table. The group provides assistance to people within the hospitality and restaurant industries. Already loaded with requests from Seattle, the group is preparing for a high volume here on the east side of the state. We're all in a specific situation and how do we stand together? And I think that will resonate for years to come. Food is a universal language that speaks to the heart of communities. And for Shaw, it's about bringing people together, if not physically at the restaurant, then within spirit. Reporting in Spokane, Laura Papetti, Creme 2 News.